What up, YouTube? We back for another review, man. And this one's to that Michael Connolly's The Late Show. And I'm not prepared to say that this novel is trash. But I'm not here on this channel to tell you that it's good either. You feeling me? Which is why I'm giving this novel the red light. You know, there are a couple scenes in the book that I can say, oh, that was kind of interesting, but let's keep it 100. In the grand scheme of, in the grand scheme of crime literature, not just because he's Michael Connolly, an author who's created a lot of great quality crime classics for people to deem him to be one of the greatest of all time and such, not just because of that, that we can say that this is disappointing, but in the grand scheme of where crime literature is, where there's way better authors writing way better novels than this, and they don't nearly have the name that Michael Connolly has, you feeling me? You sure when you look at the typical mystery genre industry, you say, oh, Michael Connolly's doing so much better than that, but we should hold Michael Connolly to a higher standard, which is why I'm giving this the red light. I mean, you can't compare what Michael Connolly and what Dan Brown has done in the game. No, it's apples and oranges. If you're going to compare Michael Connolly to somebody, you should compare him to some of the best. But let's go ahead and break down what the storyline is about, because um, what this The Late Show introduces is a new character by the name of Renee Ballard, who works the graveyard shift known as The Late Show, which is the, which is the title of the book, of course. She investigates a series of incidences, one where a prostitute gets badly beaten to death, and in another, she gets called to a, to a local bar nightclub where, where a waitress who... <coughs> where a waitress who was working there actually ends up getting shot and killed. So, so, but the late show has lackluster character development. The suspense, the tension are, is not there. It has, it has, um, so what I, I meant to say was, um, Renee Ballard's story is, is highly unbelievable and not to mention without giving any spoilers, the ending comes off completely from left, left field, if I should say. So, but that's my take on the late show. Let me know what you think of the book have you read it do you like it love and hate it let me know down in the comment section below also don't forget to like and subscribe to this video for future videos and content i'm xavier professor x wishing you all very well and a very safe day and i hope to see you in the next video take care